I think the tannery is a great place. It's not necessarily a place where you're going to get a lot of creative input in terms of your work, but it sort of inspires you because you see a lot of working artists. So it isn't as if we sit or, you know, I, it's not like Paris in the 1920s where people are going into cafes and, um, you know, generating new ideas. I think everybody does that on their own, at least the people that I know. But it's great to be in a place where everybody is a working artist, that they do their art as a big part of their life. So I think it inspires you that way. And then, you know, I think it's a great group of people. I mean, I like everybody. Artists are always known as a bit of, uh, have a bit of character. And I like living with that type of people. I like, I like that energy that's here with that. And then it's fun also associating with people that are outside the visual arts. You know, there's uh, dancers and there's uh, musicians. So that creativity that they bring in, I like as well. Sort of that, you know, a multimedia type thing. So I, I really like it. And I like the physical space as well. You know, um, I didn't know if I was going to be able to live in a place that sort of felt like going back to college dorm. But really the interaction that you have with people just... This is my first open studio, so I saw it last year with all the people that were coming in, and I thought it'd be sort of fun, that energy of people new to the area that have never seen the lofts. And so it's been fun that way. It's been interesting. Uh, you, you've got to meet a lot of people. Um, I don't know how big uh, Santa Cruz in terms of a buying audience is, but I think that you never know because one thing leads to another with these shows.